Good morning. Oh my gosh, it's the afternoon. It's like two o'clock. It is Thursday. I normally give myself Thursdays and Fridays off from vlogging, but I can't. I have too much stuff to do today, so I figured I would take you with me. I ordered a couple of pairs of shoes from DSW for my nieces for Christmas, so I need to go pick those up. I want to run into World Market because they like the different unique kind of candy there. What else? There's, there's things I need to do. So, Cash is going out. It's also 61 degrees today. So I'm wearing old navy sweatshirt, these Target like pull-on pants. I've had them for years and then these. So I have my long list, food we need. Brian and I are doing food tomorrow. And then other things that I need to pick up. I am taking back the sequin skirt from Kato because I found the other outfit at Torrid. So let's just grab all of our things and head out. Goodbye. You gonna be okay? Yeah, you'll be fine. Let me get something to drink. Diet Coke for the win. I will be back. You be good. Here's Miss Layla by the window. Oh my goodness, that was a big yawn. I see you soon. All right, so I did, oh, hello. I did the DSW shoe pickup for, pickup? Why did I just repeat that? And I ordered them about an hour ago. Um, but I'm pretty sure I still have to go inside anyways to pick them up. I just wanted to be sure I got the shoes that I wanted and the size that I wanted. So one of my nieces loves Mary Janes. So she got a pair of those. And then the other one, last time we were at DSW, so she's in between like kids' shoe sizes and like small women's shoe sizes. She's very petite. And she tried on a pair of white Doc Martens and they had them in a women's size five and they were too small. So I ordered for pickup a size six and I hope they work for her. I need to remember to get a gift receipt just in case. We just got a lot going on today. Also, tonight is date night. So Brian left a note this morning, surprised me like for our date night tonight. It's just an at home date night. So it's not really going out date night, but that's okay. It's still like, the fun of the surprise and the anticipation and all of that kind of stuff. So I'm going to try to get everything done so that I can come home, take a shower, get ready before he gets home. So first stop, let's ride down to World Market first because that's the furthest place I need to go. We'll pick out some cool candy for them and then hopefully by then at DSW I would have gotten an email and we can go pick up the shoes. If not, maybe we'll stop and get something for lunch. I do need to run to Target as well. I have an entire list of Target things, but we can always do that on Saturday, I think. My car says 68, maybe because it was in the garage. Oh, dang, it just switched to 64. Also, why am I in such a chatty mood? The last time that I saw y'all, or that y'all watched the vlog was one week ago, okay? For me, that vlog ended yesterday and I posted it live today. We're fine from the storm. It's beautiful outside, you can see. We just had a bunch of wind. I know there were tornado warnings, watches for my area, a lot of areas. We did have a ceramic pot outside that was knocked over, but it's not broken or anything. And I think by 8 p.m., it was all over for us, so we got lucky. And then I went to bed, I think I went to bed at eight, because y'all know yesterday, well, on Thursday, I went Wednesday. Today's Thursday. Why am I having brain farts? On Wednesday, I went to hot yoga at 6 a.m. So I left my house at like 5.30, 5.40. So I was up very early to do that. And I was tired, so I went to bed early. Okay, that's probably enough chatting for today because it's literally day one of the vlog and you got five more days of chatting with me. But it's an exciting vlog because I'm doing my family Christmas party this weekend on Sunday. My whole family, well, immediate family, there's seven total of us, including Brian and I, they're all coming over. And this year we're doing something a little bit different. So instead of buying gifts for everyone or drawing names, which we've done in the past, we are playing games. So I have two games. My sister has one and my mom has two. And each person to accompany the games, you bring a gift. So I have two gifts. My sister has one, my mom has two, that kind of thing. And so we play fun games. So I have my two games. And I think it's gonna be a lot of fun. I do buy gifts, like everyone buys gifts for the kids, my nieces, 
because they're kids. You know, I don't need anything. But as a kid, I feel like it's fun to get gifts. So I have them something and then I have a stocking that I put stuff in for them. And I did get my mom something, but that, she's my mom. You can't tell me not to buy my mom something for Christmas. So I think what I'm gonna do is send it home with her because she'll wake up by herself on Christmas morning and I like for her to have something to wake up to and look forward to to open. Now we're done rambling, I think. Let's go, I'll see you at World Market. All right, chocolate mushrooms and maybe something else cool for my other niece. Oh my gosh, they have one left. One. And I think I'm gonna grab one of these for my other niece. Or they have a matcha one. They always have such cool stuff here. So they have advent calendars, Italian cookies. They're 30% off. So they have chocolate, they have popcorn, cocoa, Asian noodles. But I spotted this one. 12 days of soup organic italian soups brian might like that that's kind of a fun right do we think that's fun okay we're gonna get it i think it's fun good timing dsw just emailed me and said hey your stuff is ready for pickup they do have a curbside option if you wanted to sit in your car but I don't know, I feel like it's just quicker to run in. I'll show you the shoes before we wrap them and we will wrap them in this video, but it may not be in this moment that I show you the shoes, but I will show you eventually. I am just gonna walk in and get them. It seems easier than parking in a fire lane right there and asking them to walk out to me. Hey, I just had a pickup for Taryn. They look so cute. One of them did have a little scratch, one of the Mary Janes, but she was able to get it out. And I just wanted to double check that the bottoms, were, you know, that they were actually new shoes. So I did all that. Now, here's my thing. I think I'm gonna run to Cato because Cato is in the same shopping area as Chick-fil-A. And I think that my mom would like a Chick-fil-A gift card thrown into her bag. I wonder if I can get one of those in the drive through I might put in like the curbside pickup, but were those the only things I needed to do? Oh, I did want to get a Smoothie King gift card, but I don't really know if that's on the way. We may have to save that for Saturday. Kato return. I feel like this is all happening very quick for y'all. I was just stuck in traffic for almost an hour trying to get back up to Kato. I am home now. I just ate my Chick-fil-A. I did have to go inside to order. They didn't have an option to grab a gift card on the app. And I didn't know if you could do it in the drive-thru. So I went in, look how cute. Making a gift and chicken it twice. <laughs> so this is for my mom. I need to just write on the back of it, but I wanna show you the shoes. So we have a cute pair of Mary Janes. How cute, these were the ones, they had like a little scratch on them, but she buffed it out and it was fine. So I opened them and like checked the bottom and stuff to make sure they were new and not returns kind of thing. But these, so cute. Then we got a pair of Doc Martens, again, adorable. How cute are these? Same thing, I checked the bottoms and all that kind of stuff because um, I've never purchased Doc Martens in my life, but they are expensive. Why did my voice just crack? <laughs> Because I'm shocked at how expensive they are. But they were on sale. But still, that's a lot of money. So I need to wrap those. What I think I'm going to do. Okay, well, I thought this was bigger than it is. Remember last week's vlog, Publix put some of my groceries in one of these. I was going to see if I could get another one when we grocery shop tomorrow and put their gifts in it. But no, you know what? I could. Because I'm going to have a box, like a shoe box wrapped. A bag with some things. And then I'll throw their stocking on it too. I don't know, it's just cute to me and I like keeping them all in one little bag, I don't know. And then I did get my chocolate mushrooms. I checked the expiration date on these two because sometimes World Market will get you if you don't check the expiration date and then y'all saw I got the Pocky, Pocky? Pocky snacks as well. And then I did end up grabbing, I'm pretty sure I showed y'all this anyways, the 12 days of soup. I think I'm just gonna go ahead and give this to him now. Brian loves soup. I've never met anyone in my life that loves soup so much. And granted today, the day I'm filming this, we have 10 days until Christmas, but I think it's still fun. 
12 days of soup. Plus he's half Italian. So I think he's really gonna like it. As I mentioned earlier, it is date night tonight. So I probably won't see y'all again. Tomorrow, Brian's off work, but it's a full day of, well, maybe not a full day, but we need to grocery shop for all the things we're gonna make food wise for everyone that comes over on Sunday. And then I think on Saturday, we'll go to Target and get the last few things that I wanna get for my games that I've picked, which I'll tell you about then, and the girls for Christmas. So, happy Thursday. I will see you tomorrow. Good morning, happy Friday. It's about 9 a.m. It's 52 degrees outside right now. I think the high for today is 63, but it's beautiful. So pretty. Cash, on the other hand, I won't show you right now because she's using the bathroom. Last night, there was something out here. I think it was a field mouse. And about four o'clock in the morning, she had to come outside. So I let her out thinking, oh no, she has to go to the bathroom. No, no. Luckily, she didn't get it. Um, but we were up. Me thinking she had to go to the bathroom, her trying to play. But that's okay. I'm awake. I just showered, did my skincare. I'm going to make me some coffee. I want to get ready today instead of just going out all natural. I look tired. <laughs> okay, let's get ready and then we'll go do our little bit of running around. going to get in the window? Go on. Don't be shy. They want to see you in the window. First stop Cracker Barrel for breakfast. Me as a child would have loved this. All this kind of, like the Smithsonian does it too, or like Discovery Channel, like these growing kits. I don't know. I think they're so cool. National Geographic. Like look how cool. Build your own volcano. I think these are so cool. Rock and Gem Dig. Oh, yes. Like this? Don't you think that's cool? Mm -hmm. As a kid, I loved that stuff. Like, look, build your own volcano. You want to show me your outfit? Look at that. <laughs> what are you looking at? Your new tag? Smoked them. Smoked them. All right, next up, Target. Lunch was good. Lunch we, was good. What did we get? Uh, we got the Sunday chicken and... Uh, <laughs> fried pickles and okra and sweet potato and uh biscuits and gravy bits, they brought us biscuits and gravy, and gravy. Ate a lot it oh, was good. no you ate a lot i, <laughs> I ate we should have split it we, ate, we didn't eat all of everything we should have split it all right we got a list at target brian's picking out a christmas card i'm gonna look at this jewelry usually wild fable it's like a little bit younger jewelry in my opinion. I love these for sure. These are a yes. I think they're so cute. Then I also have these. So I obviously have two nieces. <laughs> um, these are pretty cute. But then also, where did I put that other one? Oh no, I don't know where. Where did I put it? Here it is. This is so cute too. But I can't get one a big pack and one a small pack. You know what I mean? We're gonna go with these two. The two smaller packs. I do need a clothing item for one of them as well. What do we think about this? It's like a thinner sweatshirt material. I love the graphic. It's longer, like tunic length. She wears a lot of leggings. So I think I'm gonna get her the medium though, just so it's a little bit oversized. And they're 30% off. I check every time I'm at Target for the silverware that I like. So long ago, I bought some silverware, like single silverwares and we love them and they're kind of like that at the bottom, but not quite and I can never find them, but I do check every time. Target done. We got these. They taste like, what'd you say these taste like? Little cuties? Yep. These are good. All right, everything done except for oven mitts for one of the games because they were expensive here. So I guess I'll try to find those at maybe Dollar Tree or something. Brian got tired in there. He said we've been in there too long. <laughs> But we got everything we needed. That's such an ass thing to do. But you sounded good. No. You did? No. You this is no man. Okay, I took my sweatshirt off. Because it's hot. Well, it's not hot, but it's not cold. Oh my gosh, I can't get out. It's not cold enough for that. 
Ryan got the new tires. Remember I showed him when he did? We're at Publix. A few groceries, drop them off. And then I said, we're getting a few groceries. A few groceries. Drop them off. Drop them off. And then? Costco. And then? PetSmart. And then? Home. Sleep. Nap time. For you. Nap time. This is my list. Brian's grabbing croissants first. Instead of showing you every little thing, I'll show you at checkout. This is our loop. All the things, Velveeta almost got us, but we found it. Okay, let's go. Well, we've had some developments since I saw you yesterday. I wrapped a bunch of gifts. I went to put all the things I bought for my nieces in their stockings. Realized that Cash had eaten a hole in the bottom of one of them. Plus they were covered in dog hair. They were just gross. So I threw those away. I need to get some more. Also, the Publix bags that I thought would be large enough, they're actually smaller than I thought, so they don't fit all of their gifts. Well, there's only two things in a stocking, so they're pretty small. So I need to figure out, size-wise, another bag. But also, I was getting all my stuff together last night for everyone to come over on Sunday and realize, or I feel like, I don't have why my hair sticking out like that? That I don't have enough food, like snacks. So I have two more snacky foods that I wanna get. So we're gonna run to Walmart, get the snack foods, try to find some bags, and then I put in an order at Target, which I guess I didn't even need to do if I'm going to Walmart, but it's already done now. Um, put an order in at Target for a couple of stockings, and then I need a cat food. Where do we think the bags are? near the register. I figured I would check here while we were in this little area. I don't see any. Sometimes they have bags like that over here. They do have these kind of totes. Hmm. They're not very Christmassy. I mean, they are cute. Oh, they're $15. It's like a canvas tote. It's not really what I'm looking for, especially for 15 bucks. Do we get the sticks? I think we're gonna do these. We need two bags of pretzels. So these are the only shopping, like reusable shopping ones I can find. And they're all pretty much this size, the holiday ones anyways. And that's the size I have already at home that I think is too small. They do have a larger one, but it's, not holiday it's this one right here okay online it says they have a cute one on al z 21. all right so the bags aren't where they're supposed to be and no one knows where they are so what we're gonna go look at these over here one more time and then i'm over it no bags i can curbside pick them up in two hours but no one knew where they were for me to get now so I don't want to come back. So I guess I'm just going to figure out a different plan. All right, next stop is Target. Drop Brian's jacket off and then we'll go home and I'll show you, we'll pack the stockings together. We are home. I think I made a mistake. So on the ride home, I was looking online for um, bags like I wanted and Joann's, Joann Fabrics, told me that they had Merry Christmas bags. So I rode, oh my gosh, hold on, the dog needs to go out. Okay, so I rode all the way down there. It was probably, it's not in my area of town. And it showed me they had two left online, but I couldn't curbside pick them up for some reason. So I go in and they did not in fact have them. So I got these, cause they were just cute and they were half off. <sighs> They're not what I wanted. Like the color scheme, I wanted Christmas. So we'll have to see if we actually decide to put the gifts in it. But I did pick up this because we don't have a holo like a Christmas one for the kitchen. All their Christmas stuff was 70% off. So I'm happy about that. This is the one that's there right now. And then I remembered I needed some oven mitts. So we're doing two, well, we're doing quite a few games, but I have two games that I've put together or thought of or found online to play tomorrow when my family comes over. So four oven mitts, one of them, is typically I see online that you unwrap a gift wearing oven mitts, but I thought it would be even more fun to wrap them because I feel like that's harder. I'm gonna do small boxes instead of large boxes because I feel like smaller 
is probably easier than larger. So I have four because we're gonna do two against, or one against one, so everyone has two hands in my family anyway. So we needed those. And luckily I thought enough ahead for Target to order a couple of rolls of tape. So we have that for the game as well. And then the girls' stockings. I thought these were so cute. I got a red and a green one. So let's fill their stockings. I got them a lot of the same things with the exception of earrings, which I showed y'all already. Um, JC, we're gonna pack hers. I got her a Smoothie King gift card. Dr. Cats. <laughs> How cute. All right, so first we have the chocolate orange. The popping one is always so good. They each got one of these really cool foot masks and eye mask. Those are always fun. I wrapped the earrings in tissue paper because I thought it would be, I don't know, just something extra for them to unwrap. They each got candy cane chapstick. It is my absolute favorite. I love to gift it. Lindor chocolates. Though the other one is like a variety pack, but JC loves just the red ones. And then I got them these white dipped, white chocolatey dipped pretzel rods. I should have bought some of these for myself. And then I showed y'all the socks. And Allie got all the same things with the exception of, again, the earrings, which I've already shown y'all. And then I got her, I believe they're Panda Bear DJ, like a Panda Bear DJ, I thought was funny. And then instead of a Smoothie King gift card, she got this X-Men like mystery bag clip box because she is into that. And she gets the red stocking. Oh, and this is her variety pack. So it's just the red and the blue. All right, they're not the prettiest. Christmas-wise, right? But I think we're gonna do it because I just like the idea. Actually, I do like it a lot better than I thought I would. I would love it more if it was Christmas, okay? I won't say that anymore. But stocking and then the shoes. Did I show you all the other thing? I don't think so. Um, pajamas and some candy in that bag. And that's it. It's just easier. So we're doing it. I didn't even tell you all the other games. So I have two stockings because it will be identical. So what we'll have to do is go through blindfolded or close your eyes and feel in the stocking and try to write down the five items inside. So I'll have two stockings with identical items inside so that the game just moves a little bit faster. So I did buy two of these at Target. I liked the candy cane idea, but I thought an oversized one might throw people for a loop a little bit. So we have that. This, I don't know if people are gonna be able to guess this, but I love these. So I thought that would be fun and they're Christmas themed. So I only purchased two things and then I thought maybe I could put like a holiday bow that you like put on a gift in there and then maybe like an ornament or something. Like we've got enough stuff around the house that I can find three more things to put in. So that's, that's it. Everything is done. Gifts are out. I do have to pick up the chicken salad today at five. It's one o'clock right now. And then tomorrow is party day. Are you excited for the party? For everybody to come over? I know you are. I know. I'm almost ready. I have hair and makeup. I'm gonna change out of my pajamas. Um, I just ate a snack. I'm so hungry. Um, but once everything is set up in the kitchen, I will show you. I'm trying to be quiet because I'm embarrassed to talk to y'all in front of Brian for some reason today. But I'll show you the setup once everything's set up before people get here. Here's a look at my outfit. Green sweater. These leopard leggings, you can't really... Well, there you go. And then look how cute these earrings are. I love them. It's probably 5.45. Everyone should be here at 6. And here's the setup. We have pigs in a blanket. Nuggets, a couple different sauces, chicken salad, two different kind of crackers, rolls, and croissants. Brian went and picked these up today. I think that's going to be so much more helpful than regular plates. These really pretty gold silverware. So Rotel dip, a couple different kinds of chips, spicy pretzels. Oh, and then I bought these cookies too when I picked up the chicken salad, so I just put some on the island. And then we have a little drink station. Oh, and... Barbecue meatballs. My games for tonight are hidden. There's one, and there's another right there. Now we listen to Christmas music and wait for everyone to get here. I'm letting Cash go to the bathroom before everybody gets here. Uh, fun fact, my sister and I are wearing the same outfit again. 
I don't know why it's so funny. Exact same earrings, exact same top and leggings. Um, but no one knows yet until she gets here. So it's the little things. What did I say last time? It's the little things in life that make me happy. You ready? It's so cold outside. Well, for me, it's cold. It's in the 50s, I would say. You can barely see her. It's brighter in person than what you're seeing. Good morning, y'all. Happy Tuesday. It's 10. I think that's an hour fast because it's about 10, 15. It's freezing outside. Freezing for me. I think it's in the 40s. Cold, rainy, overcast. So we have a long list of things to do today. First thing is a hair appointment. That's at 11. I, okay, so I'll put a picture here from those uh, Christmas pictures Brian and I had taken. That's a better representation of my true hair color. I feel like in these videos, and especially when I stand in my filming room, my hair looks a little bit lighter. So it is quite a bit darker in real life than what you're seeing. So I know for sure I'm not in love with the, they call them money pieces in the front, the lighter pieces in the front. I don't love those. So we're gonna get rid of those, I know for sure. I don't need a haircut, we cut it last time. So that's the first step. And then I need to run to FedEx, UPS, the bank, Ulta, Publix, and I think that's it. So let's get started. But you're liking the cold weather, huh? You like it. You would think you're from up north somewhere, but you're not. Oh my gosh, it is so cold. Okay, we're done. We're back to blonde. I love it. Oh, I just feel like myself. Okay, but also, while I was in there, she says, she gives me this box and she says, this is for you. And it's a little car holder for y'all. How nice. She said she watched my videos and like, I put it where you're sitting right now. And she has this one and really likes it. That was so nice of her. So I'm gonna get this all figured out. So maybe next vlog, you won't have to watch me from way down there. And then I also bought a conditioner mask and then ordered the matching or the equivalent shampoo online. So I don't need to go to Ulta. Eliminated one trip, but I'm starving right now. It's almost three o'clock and I ate breakfast at 8.30. So I think I should probably go get food first and then we'll continue on our journey. But it looks so good, so good. I stopped at Baytown Burger, I think to get a hamburger, but here's my hair like this. It looks so good. Also the bathroom is themed. <laughs> is that a league of their own? You know what I'm talking about. Of course you do. The iconic movie, the whole place is decorated. Oh, it is, is decorated in um, sports, like baseball themed. How fun. I love it. That piece is a little wonky. Like curled wonky. I just feel better like myself, more myself with blonde hair. Good morning, y'all. Happy Thursday. Okay, so you're getting this vlog tomorrow. I have something else that goes up today. It's 1010. I just finished hot yoga, but I was one of two people in the entire class. So I asked if I could film and they said yes. So here you go. I will throw it in here. I'm not perfect. Some things I can't do all the way. Some things I can only do one set instead of two. We know the drill, but I've had a lot of questions about hot yoga. If it can be for beginners, that sort of thing, I think it can be. I'm no professional. I would consider myself more of a beginner than anything. So enjoy it and then I'll see you later.
All right, hello again. It is 3.45. I had a dermatologist appointment at one. Um, so if y'all remember six weeks ago, I went in because I had that weird rash on my neck, which we determined was from a necklace, cleared up fine. But also my eczema on my legs I wanted to chat about. So I was put on two different allergy medications twice a day. So one once a day, the other one once a day equals two pills a day. I'm happy to report I've had no issues. So she said that I can quit taking them and hopefully it just stays away. Thumbs up, subscribe, you know the drill. I'll see you in my next one, which will be after Christmas. So I hope you have a great holiday weekend celebrating how you choose to celebrate with the people that you choose to celebrate it with. That's the best part about it is seeing the people that you choose to see and that you love the most, so. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank y'all so much. The next video will be a, the first one in 2023, I think. No, it won't be 2023 yet. Anyway, thanks for watching. I will see you in my next one. Goodbye.